Good morning. My name is Terry. I just recently purchased this 2005 Mustang GT. And I got to thinking, I have a 1965 Mustang GT and how similar they are to be 40 years apart. It's hard to comprehend 40 years difference. The 65. In 65 they made 560,000 Mustangs. In 2005 they made 160,000 Mustangs. In 1965 they made 15,079 Mustang GTs. In 2005, they made 47,449 GT hardtops, like this one, plus an additional 13,343,000 ,000 GT convertibles for a total of 60,792 GTs total. Another interesting thing is the wheelbase on the 65 is 108 inches. The wheelbase on the 05 is 107 inches. So it's actually smaller, sort of. The width on the 05 is 68 inches wide. And on the 05, it's 73 inches. So it got shorter, but wider. The height on the 65 is 51 inches. And I'm sure that's with the uh, original wheels and tires. And uh, the height on the 05 is 55, well, 56 inches, basically. The length on the 05 is 187.6. The length on the 05 is 181.6. So they're very close. The curb weight on the 05 is 34.50. The curb weight on the 65 is 28.60. So they definitely gained some weight. The engine in the 65 is an A code 289, 225 horsepower. And the engine in the 05 is 4.6 liters or 281 cubic inches at 300 horsepower. The 05 has a factory five-speed transmission. The, the 05, 1905 is a factory four-speed transmission. This one's been converted to a five-speed. The 2005 has four-wheel disc brakes. The 65 had disc brakes in the front, drums in the back, but it's been converted to all disc brakes as well. The 65 had a 0 to 60 time in 8.9 seconds. The 05 0 to 60 was 5.2 seconds. The quarter mile for the 05 is 13.8 at 103. The 65 was 17 seconds at 85 miles an hour. So performance wise, there's a big difference, but they're so close. Otherwise, to be 40 years apart. I figure this is the dad and this is the son. 
And a way to go forward at uh, keeping the Mustang alive. Hope you enjoyed the little video. Have a good day.